to say, to grow. I say hello to my wife. You say good afternoon. He says it's time to go. She grows a good garden. John grows apples on his farm. We say we like apples. You say you want to see a doctor. They grow potatoes in their garden. What did the doctor say? She said I need to eat more vegetables. When did she say that? She said that when I saw her last week. Why did she say that? She wants me to eat good food every day. Will you do what she says? Yes, I will do what she says. I want to be happy. I want to eat good food. I want to be strong. I do not want to be weak and sad. I will eat more vegetables. What do you grow in your garden? We grow corn, peas, carrots, and potatoes. To cook, to clean. I cook food for my children. You clean the house every day. He cooks food at a restaurant. She cleans houses for people. John cooks rice on Sunday. You cook fish on Friday. They clean their clothes on Wednesday. I cook food for my children. You like to clean your house. He does not like to clean the car. She cleans her clothes on Tuesday. Mary cooks rice and carrots for her family. We clean our house on Saturday. I like to clean, but I like to have a clean house, so I clean my house every day. Does your husband help clean the house? Yes, he is a good husband. He helps to cook and he helps to clean. He works good and fast. The story of the family that works. One day a family went to visit friends. They said, Hello, how are you today? The friend said, We are happy today. Then the family asked, Why are you happy? The friend said, We are happy because we have a good garden. Every day we work in our garden. We have many good things in our garden. Do you want to see our garden? The family said, Yes, we want to see your garden. Where is your garden? The friend said, Our garden is behind our house. You can see our garden now. We will go behind our house to see our garden. The family said, Yes, we will go with you. They saw a good big green garden. In the garden, they saw carrots, potatoes, corn, onions, and peas. The family asked, Do you like to work in your garden? The friend said, No, we do not like to work in the garden. Mother likes to work in the garden. Father likes to work in the garden. But brother and sister do not like to work in the garden. They like to play. They play with a ball. They play with the dog. They play with the cat, but they do not like to work in the garden. The family asked, Do the children like to eat? The friend said, Oh, yes, they like to eat the carrots. 
They like to eat the peas. They like to eat the potatoes. They work in the garden not because they like to work. They work in the garden because they like to eat. Everyone laughed and laughed. The family had a good visit. Then they went to their house. At their house, they looked behind their house and they said, This is a good place for a garden. We will have a garden here too. We will work in the garden. Then we will eat food from our garden. And they did. To start, to stop. I start to read a book. You stop work at five o'clock. He starts a new job on Monday. She stops at the store to buy food. The bus stops in front of my house. We start school next week. You stop the children at play. They start to work fast. I start a new job next week. You will start on Thursday. He starts to eat, then he wants to play. She starts to sleep in the afternoon. The bus starts at 6 o'clock and stops at 11 o'clock. We start to play baseball in the morning. They want to start at 8 o'clock on Saturday. When did you start your new job? I started on Monday. I like my work. Does this bus stop at the store? No, it stops before the store. You will walk a little. Then you will see the store. Does your car start in the morning? Yes, my car does start on a good morning. But my car does not start on a bad morning. Do you want to speak English or do you want to stop? I want to speak English. I do not want to stop. I want to speak more and more every day. To learn. To understand. I learn to speak English. You learn with me. He learns very fast. She understands very well. It understands also. We understand the words in this book. You learn new words every day. They understand the words I say. I like to learn new words in English. The words in this book are easy to understand. He wants to learn more words. She wants to learn more words too. The dog understands what I want him to do. The dog learns fast. The cow learns slowly. We learn fast. They learn slowly. We will help them learn so they can understand the words we say. They need to buy food. So they need to learn the words they need to buy food when they go to the store. The story of the bus and the car. One day a man wanted to go to work. He needed to go to his job very fast. He went to the bus stop and he waited for the bus. He did not see the bus. He waited again. He did not see the bus again. Then the man said, I have a job. I need to go to work now. The, the man saw a car. The man saw his friend in the car. 
the man said, Can I ride in your car to my work? His friend said, Yes, you can ride in my car. I will drive to your work. You can go to your job with me. We will go now to your work. Then the car stopped. The friend said, Oh no, my car stopped. The man asked his friend why his car stopped. The friend said he did not understand why his car stopped. The man asked, Is this a bad car? His friend said, No, this is a good car. I do not understand why my car will not go. What will we do now? The man looked. He saw a bus. He said, I see the bus. We will go on the bus. You will go on the bus with me. So the two men went out of the car and started to walk to the bus stop. They went on the bus. The bus went to the city. The man asked his friend where he wanted to go off the bus. His friend said he wanted to go off the bus at a car garage. He wanted to speak to the people in the car garage. He wanted to learn why his car stopped. The man said that he worked near a garage. They said, we will go off the bus and we will speak with the people in the garage. The bus stopped and the two men went off the bus. They walked to the garage. They said to the people in the garage that the friend's car stopped. They said they did not understand why the car stopped. The people in the garage said that they needed to see the car to understand why the car stopped. They wanted the friend to drive the car to the garage for them to see the car and learn why the car stopped. The man looked at his friend. The friend looked at the man. Then the two men looked at the people in the garage. They said, We cannot drive the car to the garage so you can see the car because the car will not go. The car stopped and the car will not start again. The people in the garage laughed. Now they understood you cannot drive your car to our garage because your car will not go. They said, One of our men will go drive one of our cars with you to see your car. Then we will learn why your car will not go. And they did.